what is the importance of the genetics although genetics is important to every person but it is particularly important for the patients if a patient has a disease that is hereditary in nature he would like to know that how that disease has inherited and which are the individuals who are susceptible for certain diseases like if we take the example of certain diseases whether that is the diabetes or the cancer uh, one person should like to know whether he or she is susceptible for these diseases or not on parallel basis genetics is also important for the researchers for the geneticist or for the scientist who would like to know what is the pattern of inheritance of different genes how different genes they behave they act what kind of proteins they produce whether the genes they are producing uh, structural proteins or they are producing the functional proteins so it means we can say that genetics is important to everyone either it can be a normal layman or it can be a patient or it is a scientist what is the characteristic of our genetic data there are some characteristic of our genetic data like our genetic data is personal every person has a specific sequence of the genes that gene they predict what kind of the proteins will be produced from the sequence data of those genes so the genetic data of every person is a personal thing second the genetic data is permanent what a person has inherited from the parents either from the mother side or from the father side that will be a permanent characteristic of every individual this permanent characteristic cannot be changed like the sequence of my genes or the sequence what i have inherited from my parents that cannot be changed like if we take the example of the sex sex cannot be changed the other thing uh, 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 genetic data is also predictive with the help of sequence of the genes or with the help of the chromosome bending patterns we can predict about certain diseases or we can also predict whether some in, uh, any individual is susceptible for a particular disease or uh, he she is not susceptible for a, a particular disease so genetic data can be personal genetic data is permanent and genetic data is predictive genetic helps us in many ways like genetic helps us in the diagnostics and certain treatments genetic helps us to predict and to plan the future that based on the genetic data how we can uh, how how we can predict how we can plan to save from certain diseases those diseases which are usually caused by the genetic as well as by the environmental effect genetics also helps us for the screening purposes for the screening of the newborn babies genetics also helps us for pharmacogenomics like for the personalized medicines so these are those ways by which genetic genetics helps us what are the long term impact of the genetics there are certain impacts of the genetics during our life span genetics has the impact on insurance policies if someone has a particular disease maybe there are certain restrictions by the policy makers or by the insurance companies who provide the the insurance to uh, to the individuals a person can face difficulties for getting the employment if a person has a, a particular disease maybe he she will not be offered a a, a a a a a job as well as we can also genetics can also help us during the medical care it can also helps us to adopt our lifestyle based on the genetic 
characteristics. Genetics also helps us to understand the process of evolution that how the evolution has merged that how the uh, organisms they developed from unicellular organisms into multicellular organisms.